What's up, party people? This is Nina Perez, and this is Straight Talk, No Sugar Added. And you know I go around this amazing planet of ours trying to find the best humans on it to come on here to grow, challenge, and transform your thinking. I am so excited about this episode because I have been watching these two guys. They, I don't know how they got into my feed and all of that, but they did. And so I'm so glad I found them. Today we have Jeremiah, and he is the co-founder of the Banking Bros, where they crack the code to cash flow. <laughs> That's their thing, right? So with his younger brother, Jonah, they decided to build an educational platform that would help break down the concept around the high cash value whole life insurance as a banking system. So now they teach, they train, they sp uh, they train people and they speak at live events and they do all of that. And I was really, really honored that he took my DM because maybe he, he was like, I got too many of those, but he took my DM and he came on the show and he's going to bless you guys with some knowledge. So Jeremiah, thank you so much for being on Straight Talk. I appreciate you. How are you? Hey, Nina, thank you so much. I'm so happy to be here today and anytime wonderful lady like yourself slides into the DMs, you know, I'm going to get to it sooner or later. So I appreciate what you do. And uh, thank you for having thank me you. on today. Hopefully I can help. Yeah, I think you you can. I mean, I've been watching a lot of what you do on TikTok and on YouTube and stuff like that. And I uh, signed up for, uh, I think I have the course now and I'm getting it. You know, I'm just trying to learn all of it. And I even picked this up. It just got here. Oh, good. Okay. Very good. So, so you're doing your homework. I love it. I, I, I'm trying because I want to also crack the code to cash flow in my life. Um, and so, Jeremiah, let's start off with uh, letting my audience know a little bit more about you. First of all, guys, if you see my boy over here eating, it's OK. I've given him permission. Okay. Thank you. He can, Thank eat you. Okay. he can eat while he's on the show. I love it. I love that he is him. All right, Jeremiah, tell me who you are. Who are Thank you? Thank you so much. So uh, I am nearing 40 years old at this point, and I live in Greenville, South Carolina with my wife and four children. Awesome. Oldest is eight, and the youngest is six months. Cool. And uh, like Nina mentioned, thank you so much uh, for doing your homework on us. What we do here at the Cash Compound and the Banking Bros is we help people understand the infinite banking concept. What the heck is it? So many people have been talking about it yeah. and places like TikTok and Instagram and other social channels and feeds have been pushing it more and more. People are hearing about this. It's not so secret anymore. Mm -hmm. We became students of that about eight years ago. And I was doing other things at the time, Nina. I was, uh, I've was i been known in my neck of the woods to be an MC, an entertainer, an entrepreneur. And so I do a lot of speaking, a lot of sports entertainment, family entertainment stuff. And oh. uh, it all started for me when I just became acquainted with this concept and became a student. So but well before we were doing things in teaching and training and helping people understand it, um, I was slinging T-shirts at college uh, basketball games and uh, MCN minor league baseball games and things like that uh, in South Carolina where I live. So that is a little bit about me and what's been going on for the last decade or so. So you were trying to make things happen anyway, right? Like you were trying to do it. Uh, in, in, I think in the normal and traditional way that we all try, right? You hustle, you go out, you do, you, you put your money in the bank, you try to, you know, put your money, I don't know, right now it's in crypto or whatever it's all in. Right. And so, um, that's, you know, that's the kind of same road as me, you know, entrepreneurship and all that great stuff, but something feels wrong, Jeremiah, something right. feels freaking wrong, right? You put your money in the bank, you get like a 0 0.000.1%. Right. Like, it's like, it's a hustle. It's a hustle. Right. So, I was, I don't know how you guys popped up on my radar, but you did. And I'm glad you did. Um, and then I was uh, looking into what you were saying and saying, high cash value, whole life insurance. What is he talking about? Right, what are you talking right, about? What is right, that? What right. is that? And, but I, I'll tell you, I will, I will give you this compliment, you and your brother. You guys feel real and you feel um, relatable. And I think that that is a hard thing to do is to sell something that nobody knows about and make it make yourself feel relatable and real. That's a that's a that's a gift. That's a gift. So I want to I wanted to maybe break it down just a little bit for my audience. What the difference is between like say 
what you're what you're talking about just high cash value whole life insurance and maybe term insurance or other insurance yeah. or something like that because i i used to be a dave ramsey fan i still like him. oh yeah oh yeah. yeah still like him a lot but i when i was gonna get into the you know whole life insurance he was like no don't you dare it's all term right so i got a term policy right, like right. 15 years ago and yep. now i hear you guys and i'm a little pissed off <laughs> that it's I really cool, isn't it? Yeah. So um, I would appreciate that. Yeah. When we started to understand this concept and be taught ourselves about eight years ago, as I mentioned at this point, we weren't interested in somebody talking over our heads. Look, mm -hmm. we work hard. Like you mentioned, we work hard. We're good people. A lot of people like me already for the things that I was doing in the community. Why is it? I just can't figure out how to get money right. What is it? it? It is this haves and have nots that can't be. There's got to be a clearer path to understand mm -hmm. what it is. So when we do our teaching and training, and if you follow us on TikTok or whatever, you're not going to have us talking over your head. We're right. not going to act like you don't know. We're not going to act like you can't figure it out. We're going to say things like you were educated incorrectly. You're probably thinking about this backward. Mm -hmm. because you really want money to grow and cash flow for you. How right. hard is that, right? Even, of course, my eight-year-old daughter knows that. We want it to grow and cash flow. So that's what we're doing, and we're teaching this. But you, exactly how uh, you started is how I started my financial um, kind of journey. Uh, when I was 21, 22, getting out of college, um, I have a communication degree, but I didn't know anything about money. I stayed away from mm -hmm. math class mm -hmm. after 10th grade. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so my mom told me, I found this dude on the radio you need to listen to. And among many other wonderful things, he had this specific way that he talked about and talked against certain things in life insurance, right? So I ain't got no shade for Dave Ramsey. I have met the man, okay? I've read all of his books. I've read all of his yeah. books. However, when he's talking about life insurance, he's talking about coverage for death. And right. when we're talking about the book you just held up, banking, where the banking mm -hmm. grows. But mm -hmm. we're not banking when we're dead, Nina, right? How much money right. do you need if you're dead? <laughs> Same I as me. Right. Nothing. I don't need anything if I'm dead. So that's not what right. we're talking about. We're just happening to use a tool that can accomplish so much more than what we've been educated on. Most of us have a misconception about life insurance based on someone else's opinion or telling us what it was about. Right. However... There is a growing, guaranteed, and cash flowing component of whole life insurance. That's not going to exist in uh, term insurance. Term insurance is for the coverage of death. We're not talking about investment. I did say the word guaranteed, did I not? Yeah. Guaranteed and growing. So we're not talking about an investment. And we're not talking about risk. So it can't go backward. I did say the word guaranteed. You see, now, if those things are true, in a product that hasn't changed much in 200 years, we should be able to break it wow. down for each other and help us understand. So, yeah, we started to learn uh, about this uh, concept of utilizing the growing cash values inside a whole life insurance policy from a mm -hmm. mutual company. That means we're getting dividends as well. And we're using cash while we're alive. Now, Nina, I've listened to a couple of your podcasts now. And you're looking at me and you're listening to me. So I'm obviously not dead. All right. I think mm -hmm. you're you're not a bot either. OK, no, I'm so, not. OK, so while we're here, we need more money than we did yesterday. True. Yeah. Yeah. OK, of cool. So if that is possible, utilizing this tool, we need to pay more attention to it and not just take someone else, even as good of a guy as Dave Ramsey may be. We need to actually look to see if this is true. If there are always guarantees growth and cash flows then the number doesn't even matter. I just want to get my right. money parked right there. So do you think that this is something that even um, life insurance agents should be learning about? Because I've never heard the concept before, right? And I've talked to different insurance you know, agencies and different insurance um, uh, you know, agents out there saying, oh, well, this is the best policy and this is why, but none of them have brought this up. Right? right. So I'm thinking maybe they're not even educated right. on this. Is that right? So you've started to figure it out. Right. So yeah. you are exactly correct. So I, prior to this uh, information, of course, was always looking for the least amount of premium to give me the most amount of coverage. That's it. Mm -hmm. There was mm -hmm. no cash flow yeah, same. in there at all. Right. I, I yeah. just uh, Car insurance, phone insurance, my wife's wedding ring. 
least amount that I have to pay to get the most amount of coverage. That's all I care about. Well, that's not what we're talking about here, right? The concept is banking. The concept is actually money and cash flow. So you're exactly right. Most agents out there, and by most, I mean 99.9% of insurance agents and life insurance agents also were not taught this information. They right. weren't taught how to utilize cash values from whole life insurance out of the get-go. Out of the get-go. That's another thing that so many folks I was folks just going to ask that. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So, um, yeah, they're there to help you take care of your family when you're gone or if you're gone. See, the thing is but crazy about term insurance, there's nothing wrong with it, but it only pays out if you die early. If you die during right, the term, it plays out. <laughs> Right. And that's fine. That's right. good, right? Right. So we're right. going to be covered if we do. But I mean, I ain't trying to die early. What if I right. live as long as my mom? What if I live as long as my grandma? They're both still right. here. So if I live right. that long, I'm not going to be having this term anymore. We've got to figure right. out how to always have cash flow. Yeah. And so that's, you know, that's a very interesting point you brought up too, because um, I feel like what you and uh, Jonah talk about are different than what I've heard other people talk about when they talk about um, cash in their insurance policies, a lot of them talk about retirement or only mm. having it for retirement. So I'm assuming, cause you just said it could be immediate, right? It could be like, yeah. right. So that's a little different than what I've been hearing with it being right. a retirement thing. So this is a whole different, a whole different ball game we're playing with here, right? This is a we whole are. different So thing. yes, yeah. one of the things and differentiators about the infinite banking concept and many people who talk about maybe just generic terms, cash flow banking or having money in a policy, they may be talking about different types of policies. Right. And depending right. on how those policies work, number one, and number two are customized in their construction, you may or may not have any cash value to use out of the gate. Now, Nina, mm -hmm. I don't know about you, but coming up in 2023, I've got stuff to buy. I've got cars to buy, houses to buy. I got stuff to get into. I'm sure you have money you'd like to spend as well. Mm-hmm. Okay, great. Mm -hmm. So I'd yep. also like to have money in retirement. Right. So if I can right. have both without compromising one for the other, then wouldn't you want to go for it? Wouldn't you yeah. want to utilize money today and not ever compromise the fact that one day I hope to be retired and have passive cash flow coming in too? Right. right? That's all right. retirement means is the point at which the money keeps coming in and I don't have to work for it and it takes care of my bills. Right. That's right. not an age. That's actually a money income time it's right. not it's not an age right if i had dollars that came in no matter what and they covered my so here's the thing we can build that system starting today on purpose without any risk and without ever right. giving up control of our money so it's really crazy i'm with you because yeah. who knew who knew right. that life insurance could solve that type of problem i was like well yeah he told me i was going to go to hell if i bought right. whole life insurance i was like well i'm not trying to go to hell and i'm not trying to die like why would i buy this you know <laughs> Yeah. Yes, I know. It, it actually scared me into the term and that's what I ended up doing. But, right. um, you know, can anyone join though, Jonah? I mean, is this something that, are there like restrictions? Is there something that you, you can't have if you join? Like what, what's, what is that about? Like, remember, I know, so we're utilizing yeah. at the base, the base product for your banking system is life insurance. So mm -hmm. anyone can own life insurance. Now, you don't have to be the insured body, but most often we are talking about me covering myself and utilizing my policy's growth. I However, see. I might be able to get it on my spouse or my mm -hmm. kids if my body doesn't qualify. So I always say that Abraham Lincoln and Martin Luther King both tried to call in yesterday to get life insurance and they said, uh-uh, you're dead. So that's right. the number one thing. You got to be alive. Okay. Life okay, insurance. Number one. <laughs> okay. Got you got to be alive, but you don't actually have to be the body that is the insured person if you don't qualify, right? There are many different and myriads of reasons. Most people think about health um, as their non qualifying things, but there's other factors uh, as well that could potentially okay. knock you out of the game. But that doesn't mean if I was, un if I were an unsurable, that doesn't mean that I can't own a growing banking system. But oh, okay. the policy might be on my wife or on okay. my kids. You see, I own the policies on them. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's very interesting. Okay. So then you, so then I guess the answer is, yeah, I guess anybody can mm -hmm. really join at yep. any age. It's just how you strategically do it. Right. Yeah. yeah. Because yeah, it. my grandmother is now at an age where the infinite banking concept 
would no longer be able to be a workable contract. Policy and contract can be interchangeable words. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. She would not be able to qualify for that on herself because she's 80 plus. Right, However, right. she could own it on her adult children, on her grandchild, me. Oh, you see, and she okay. can still have mm -hmm. growing cash flow. She owns the policy. She's not the body, right? Because we all know Got that our great grandma it. had Gerber, right? They had those Gerber policies and they yes. bought them on us when we were kids. You didn't own it when you were a kid. They owned it. You were the body. Yeah. yeah. So even okay. if you're an adult, even if you're an yeah. adult. Yeah, huh. of course. That's interesting. So even if you're an adult, so Jeremiah, say so your grandma says, I'm going to own a policy on you, Jeremiah, because you're healthy and strong and you're eating nice, good stuff on TV so I can see you're eating well. Welcome to so Moe's. <laughs> Welcome to Moe's. That's all I'm eating. So. <laughs> and so what, what if you own a policy, though, and she owns a policy on you? Is that possible or no? Of course. Yes. So here's oh. the thing. Now, I'll break it down like this. I am going to answer your question. Here's the two minute version of the answer. The answer is now, Nina, you drive cars and I drive cars, right? Mm -hmm. Of yep. course. And God forbid a tree falls on your car. Somebody runs into you. You want the insurance company to pay for your car. That's why you have of car course. insurance. Yes. OK. Right. Now, right. how much is your car worth? Let's say it's worth fifty thousand dollars. OK. Mm -hmm. Now, how mm -hmm. much insurance would you buy so the insurance company could pay out the full amount? How much a amount of insurance would you buy on a $50,000 car? How much do you want them to pay out? Well, I want them to pay out the full value of the car. The full right? thing. Or, okay. Yeah, Me yeah. too. The full value. Here's the thing. Most people insure themselves in life insurance, not at their full value. Mm. So when you decide to put money in the game and give it to an insurance company and it buys a amount of money on you, nobody ever asks how much they were worth. That's the only question you ask about your car. How much is the car worth? So I want to huh. insure all of it. But on yourself, you never ask how much you're worth. You just say, oh, I'll get a hundred thousand. I'll get 200,000. Well, Nina, what if you're worth a million? See, if right, you right, right. have a hundred thousand dollars in coverage, death benefit, which is not the same thing as the pool of money for banking and cash. Right, but if you right. have a hundred thousand dollars in coverage or death benefit and you're worth a million, you are underinsured nine hundred thousand dollars. Right. So right. you are allowed to have as many policies as you like until you hit how much you're worth. Oh wow, that's very interesting. Yeah. So tell me about uh, the banking bros because that's you know you you guys are very well versed in what you do, and I want my audience to know. I think I have about uh, I think it's like twenty to thirty thousand downloads a month. So Great. they're listening, and I want to let them know how, you know, what is it that the banking bros is doing for them? What are you doing? Yes. Now, first off, we thank you for still being here. All of you out here who listen, who are still here and you haven't gotten scared away because we said whole life insurance 10 times. Right. Okay. So if you're still out there, this is what you need to understand. There is a system out there that's always been here in North America, that if you place your dollars inside of this system, you have guaranteed growth and a growing cash flow pool of money that's separate from your contribution. It's called premium because the mm -hmm, vehicle mm -hmm. is whole life insurance. And that's what we teach on at the Banking Bros. So our agency is called the Cash Compound. And what we do first is educate. We want folks to understand the infinite banking concept and how to use privatized banking, cash flow banking, the infinite mm -hmm. banking concept. That's what we're teaching people, how to become the banker. So right. it's not just about the product. The product is just what we use to become the banker and control ever-growing cash flows in our lives, guaranteed. So we have a library of content out there. We do social media. The banking bros, me and my brothers, what we call ourselves, but actually the umbrella is the cash compound. So if you're looking for us, you can find us in both places, depending on where you're looking. And uh, that's what we teach. We're students of the game. So right. I, Nina, right now, I do this process. I own nine different banking branches. So I have nine banks, whole life insurance contracts that grow and I utilize for cash in my life. I save my money and I spend someone else's, the insurance right. company. So right. that's what we help people understand. And I go live most days actually on TikTok over the course of this uh, 
eight, nine months. I've been live a lot and folks like yourself have been able to see what we do. So mm -hmm. we put out a lot of marketing content. Uh, we have a group of folks who all practice this concept. You can ask us anything because we all do it. Uh, who mm -hmm. answer the phone calls and we help folks really um, crack that code to cash flow and we help them get started. So I know that you do the big educational concept. Uh, that's where I've been learning a lot of my material, uh -huh. um, reading a lot and whatever. So are you also how are you like agents as well? Like, are you helping people develop these, you know, develop these policies? Because it's one thing to learn it. It's a whole nother thing to actually know what to click and what to actually add on to it. Right. You're exactly right. There are many different types of insurance. Yeah. Right. We talked about it before. You got fire insurance. You got phone insurance. We're right. talking about specifically design whole life insurance. To do that, yes, we have to be licensed. So I am a licensed life insurance agent. Okay. And we're licensed in all 50 states. We live in South Carolina and we help people all over the place. My brother was in Puerto Rico helping the, uh, the folks over there uh, just this past month. Uh, so yes, we are licensed everywhere and we can help everybody. Uh, okay. You can also do this practice in Canada, actually. So there are different rules and tools, slightly different variations up there because they have different laws and different insurance companies. But you can also practice this concept up there and we send people up there as needed. But uh, yeah, so we're actually doing this. We're doing it ourselves. We're teaching the concept and we're licensed agents everywhere so we can help you and answer your questions. Okay, great. Because I think one of the the biggest questions I think would probably come up is, at least I saw this a lot on your lives, is um, what's the lowest amount I can get in with and what's the lowest monthly payment and, you know, or what, how high can we go? Like, I see that those kind of questions pop at you a lot. So they I'm do. assuming that you break that down during the during the phone call, right? Yes, right. Of yeah. course, everybody's um, policy and design and personhood is specific, right? Right. So your policy is different because of age, because of gender, because of health and the amount of money you'd like to deposit in. But see, these are banks. Now, Nina, I like deposits. I've always right. wanted more deposits. I hope I'm getting more deposits next year. <laughs> so when we put dollars inside, we don't like to use the word payment. We like to use premium deposits because we're Makes putting sense. money in Makes a bank. Mm -hmm. We're going to mm -hmm. use this money. We're going to mm -hmm. utilize the growth of this money. Mm -hmm. So you get to pick that premium. I want everybody to know right now, we're not forcing you into any specific number. Premiums in whole life insurance are level. They are consistent. Cost of insurance does not rise, does not change. The insurance will never send you a different bill for your deposit. Right. Right. But everyone out there gets to pick what they want to do. That's awesome. So tell me, uh, Jeremiah, where's the banking bros going from here? What do you what do you plan in the future? We What's are happening? so excited about the future. Uh, you know, we were we were students of the game, as I mentioned. And uh, for five years, uh, we have been helping someone else kind of set the tone for how we can market and help and teach and kind of do an aftermarket service. But what we decided to do is we in the last couple of years here, we just started making more and more content and online mm -hmm. stuff like that. And so we have the courses, as you as you know, there we're 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 fostering a community because if folks are having more and more cash flows that they can use for things. See, we help them get out of debt in the beginning. Right. Mm -hmm. So what's one of the main things that we're helping folks do eight out of 10 people who come to us and get started with the banking system actually have consumer debts. They're paying mm -hmm, all their mm -hmm. interest and all their future earnings out yeah. to someone else and they're not keeping yeah. it. So we actually utilize cash flows from cash value to pay off their bills with other people's money. OPM. You've mm -hmm. heard that before, right? Other people's money, right? You've heard pay yourself right. first. So when we learn to pay ourselves first, we're actually utilizing other people's money, a growing asset and borrowing against it, income tax free to pay off debts and things like that. So the sky's the limit. One of the next things that I'm sure you'll see coming soon is um, a larger breadth of um, potential agents to help us spread this message awesome. and more content from us in 2023, as well as um, new avenues for utilizing that cash flow post debt payoff. So investment good. opportunities, cash flows, yeah. cash flow investments. But yeah, that's good. That's good. Because you know what, Jeremiah, I think, uh, you know, 
I I know I know that what you're doing is uh, really valuable because I know that it's starting to change my whole mindset, my whole mindset, right? And I'm just the one of the many thousands that listen to you guys. Um, so you're doing a phenomenal job, and I thank you guys for being so clear. Um, and I will be calling you to do a policy so that's a good thing because i do need one and right. i probably will be doing it i'm i don't know can i do them on my grandkids i'll probably do them on my grandkids too of course of course <laughs> why not we'll talk it over um, we'll talk it over. We'll talk it, but no this is uh this has been phenomenal and i just i really wanted to have you on because i know that i speak to a lot of um, different experts on here and i haven't had this yet i haven't had this concept yet so i know that this is going to really resonate with a lot of the people who are listening so I want to let them know where they can go and find you, follow you, like join your course like I did, all that great stuff. So give us all that. Yes, wonderful. So appreciate it. And thank you. So I've got a special gift for all the folks out there in uh, this audience here for Straight Talk. And uh, I'm going to hook you up with our first course on the house. We want you to jump in there and dive in there for that. So if you're looking for us online, thebankingbros.com thecashcompound.com. Either one of those will lead okay. you toward what we're doing. If you're on TikTok, you're going to love The Banking Bros. I'm often live there all the time. So at The Banking Bros. Instagram is the same there. And we have mm -hmm. our YouTube channel. Okay. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. if you'd like to jump in and dive into, we have kind of two great ways to get acquainted with what we do. One is our presentation. So I'll share that with Nina here so you guys can get to that if there are show notes. And so you can get mm -hmm. to our hour presentation. You don't have to sign up or log into anything. We're just going to give you the information, right? It's all custom and complimentary around here. We want to help you understand it. And right. number two is our crash course. So we have a library of courses we'd love for you guys to know about. And inside that library of courses, the crash course is kind of our introductory course five-minute videos, interactive response stuff where you can learn about how to guarantee growth and more and more cash flows in your life for the rest of your whole life. And that course code, yeah, everybody ready who's listening, who's still here, right? We lost a few Dave Ramsey fans already, Nina. I don't know. I don't know. I might have. <laughs> that crash course code is bank with us, okay? Bank with us. And if you type that in, that will give you access to the crash course. We hope that you decide after learning, being led a little bit about what's going on, that you get on a one-on-one -on -one call with me, with Jonah, or some of the other folks, or the bros who are in our office to help you uh, guide you through, answer your questions. Nothing to sell you, but uh, we hope that... Uh, you go ahead and click a free consultation, all right? We, we see yeah. that um, button clicked a lot from a lot of people who just need to know more, and we're happy to do it for you. That's great. Thank you, Jeremiah. I have one quick question for those who are still hanging on to the to their uh, show and listening. Uh -huh. um, I, you said something in the beginning. I just wanted to touch on it. You said this has been around for over 200 years, right? About 200 years or so. It so that's, um, that means that it's lasted through a lot of hard times. And as you know, that people are going through some hard times right now with the recession and this inflation and all that stuff. Do you think it's a good thing and a good, uh, good mindset to go ahead and start using your own banking system at this time of our lives? What's going on in yeah, it's a great question. So you're right. I mean, prior to the automobile, prior to the Civil War, prior to the IRS, ladies and gentlemen, and the Fed, 1913, prior to that, whole life insurance has been guaranteed to grow and give you cash flow. It's always been here in the American economy. So there must be something going on with it. On yeah. top of that, your bank and my bank, the conventional banks that we have our Visa cards and our checking accounts from, look it up. Bank-owned life insurance, your bank, ladies and gentlemen, who's listening to me, if you're hating or you're ingesting this information and loving mm -hmm. it, your bank owns more whole life insurance than any other asset. They own more of this than they do real estate. So it. there's something going on that I have a feeling you didn't know about. So all you have mm -hmm. to do is tap into the plug, right? Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. here's the question that I'll ask, and it comes from that old Chinese proverb or wherever they say it comes from. The best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago. Right. The second best time is today. So let's get today. started. Yeah. Let's get started. It time yeah. is going to pass. The question is, where is your money? Is it compounding and growing for you no matter what? 
and you can still have liquid access to be able to use it and control it and spend it or finance anything you buy. So my suggestion is we needed to figure this out as close to yesterday as possible. Yeah. Amen to that. Amen to that. Thank you so much, Jeremiah. This was such a blessing. And I know that this was a lot of uh, knowledge dropped. And I really appreciate that. I love the straight talk. You got to the point and you just let us know that we just got to get off our get off our laurels and get onto the game is what we got to right. do. So thank you so much for being here. Appreciate you. Appreciate thank you, you so much, Nina. All right. Blessings awesome. to you. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. I told you you guys would love this guy. I knew you would. Make sure that you guys follow them because I've been following them. I'm telling you, I have been growing. I can't stop thinking about it. I have the book next to my bed. I'm reading it. They need to write the book. They need to write a book too because it's so good. Their info is so good. Go get on those courses. I'm telling you, best thing you will ever do. Thank you guys for being here. Nina Perez, Straight Talk, No Sugar Added. Until next time.